Hello, hope you are well. My name is Frank and welcome back to my channel. It is a pleasure to have you here with me. And guys, the fact that I haven't rescued a Russian or Ukrainian girl yet is a testament that I really need to, to leave my house. And some of you guys haven't gotten the joke. The reason I'm calling myself Nutrition Genius is because everyone else seems to copy me, although I personally don't think I am a genius. So today we're just gonna uh, go around, do a little pantry and food tour, show you guys what I've been eating. Although, you know, my diet doesn't have too much variety, but there is a rhyme to the reason. Is that the saying? I'm fucking not. So, in the middle of making my dinner tonight, we have some filet mignon that's sliced up from Frankie's syringe meat. We're going to put that on baguette from the French Bakery. Over here we have the trusty water kefir grains as well as orange flavored water kefir. Uh, we did put the kefir grains on sale on the website guys, frankdesyringefoods.com. Lowest price online, almost half as much as uh, all the other ones that are available and it's much higher quality. It's in glass, it's mineral water, nothing else like it online. Same with the water kefir. I think we have lemon, apple, and regular in stock. Over here, just a bunch of odds and ends, guys. Sometimes I have, you know, the organic brown rice. Sometimes I'll have the flextrose as a sweetener for some stuff. We got some Frankie steak seasoning snuck in there. I usually put that on my potatoes. And we got some B vitamins mixed in. And underneath here is some mastic gum that we have been putting in the spice grinder. And here are some of the Bolivian rose salt from Frankie Strange Meat that I use whenever I need salt on anything. This is the brand of coconut oil I use just refined MCT oil to cook with. And then we have just some cannellini beans that I'll have with the rice. But for the most part, my meals have been uh, the steak sandwiches lately. Some more baguettes. I usually get four at once, which lasts me the better part of a week. Plenty of organic apples here. We have some organic lemons. I got to do some lemon juice in the morning. I keep being too lazy to do that. These are organic potatoes. I use these to make my french fries slash potato chips for every meal with the sandwich and underneath there there's some onions and garlic we might have for another recipe. So in our fridge here I have some goat testicles that I have to have in the morning tomorrow for some testosterone. Really gives me an energy boost. This is the collagen broth that we made. So we put some oxtail in here. It's nice and gelatinous. This is like a, a jus and very high in amino acids. I feel very good. I'll, I'll dip the baguettes in this. Uh, you guys saw me do that a couple weeks ago. And back there is just some more collagen broth. Uh, speaking of eggs, guys, uh, we should actually have the eggs available late next week, uh, which I will announce on Frankie's Free Range Meat. Nothing else really in here. I usually get meat down from the warehouse every day, so I just have another uh, filet mignon steak that we have right now on Frankie's Syringe Meat. Uh, I tried to have some organic hummus, but it gave me a pretty bad headache, a little too high in fat. I was dipping these tortillas in that hummus, and these are a bit too high in fat too, although the ingredient list is way better than all of the other uh, tortillas I've seen in the supermarket because all they put in it is flour, avocado oil, salt, and water. I actually didn't see that. They put cassava in there, which is um, very bad for your liver, the cyanide content. So. I don't know, you guys can see how you feel eating these, but not again. So for water lately, I've been using Mountain Valley and Fiuji, usually Mountain Valley to rinse stuff with, and the Fiuji to drink, and the, the kefir is made from Mountain Valley. So plenty of minerals just in the water. So over here we just have some organic bananas, and sometimes I don't feel like peeling an apple or I'm like really hungry and the banana is higher in calories, higher in starch. Uh, this is just a bunch of random stuff. Uh, some potato chips my mom's been eating. I've basically tried every single brand of potato chip at the store, and I don't like any of them. There's pros and cons to each one. You know, Boulder Canyon does have some avocado oil, and they even have um, olive oil chips, too. But they're not organic, and a little too high in fat. It didn't feel too great eating them, but uh, my mom has been eating these now. Just a bunch of beans here. Uh, we might do a bean recipe on Saturday if I feel up to it, so keep an eye out for that. But uh, the rest of the stuff here, I don't, I don't really have. We did put the air fryer outside, guys, mainly because it gives off a lot of smoke and that also reduces the radiation. So in here, just some french fries that I'm cooking for dinner. 
As I said guys, not too much stuff, especially considering it's every single thing I put in my body. So you know, when you only have 10 to 20 foods that you're eating, it's very easy to control the quality and feel good doing it. I did, however, you know, cheat, deviate on the diet a few times this week. So like I woke up at, you know, eight, nine or 10 o'clock in the morning, I had to run down to work, work a few hours. Da, da, da. By then it's one or two o'clock and I haven't eaten all day. So you know, I would stop by Whole Foods, pick up some jerky or chips or protein bars and every single time I felt horrible because there's not really anything you can get even from like a whole food store like Whole Foods that doesn't have a ton of additives in it that are going to make you feel like crap at least to have a complete meal. Maybe next week we'll do a little tour around the house to show you guys some things I do here and there just to stay a bit healthier whether it's getting some fresh air going outside. Uh, one thing I really wanted to do was show you guys like what I eat at the warehouse as a snack but uh, the apple bars haven't been uh, made properly lately and we might have some new kind of like granola-esque bars in the next a uh, week or two or three so I'm really excited for those if we can get those soon so definitely keep an eye out for that but you guys can get the meat on Frankie's Free Range Meat, the water key for key for grains and some other interesting products on Frankie's Free Range Foods. As you guys can see I'm wearing my Wi-Fi shielding a long sleeve shirt and pants you can go around the supermarket in all black looking like some type of secret Asian if you'd like to but uh, even just compared to the t-shirt I feel a lot better with the full body coverage so I do try to wear this as much as possible you guys can check that on Wi-Fi shilling.com as always guys I've been using the deodorant products and Frankie's Naturals just go to frank you can see all the businesses guys get an idea of all the interesting products if you'd like to support me so, outside of that, if you guys could drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Thanks again for joining, guys, and I'll see you for tomorrow.